We are joined as well by Gab Marcotti, and that is where we will begin. Gab, Kyle Walker for 50 million pounds going from Spurs to City. Almost a done deal? Uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty much a done deal. The, the, certainly the, the two clubs have agreed a price. Uh, you would imagine that uh, it's going to be pretty straightforward uh, to get uh, Kyle Walker to agree terms. In fact, I'm sure they've already been talking to each other. Um, and I know that people are going to uh, scoff at the price, but one key thing to bear in mind here is uh, Manchester City have a serious dearth of, uh, of, 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 of players who satisfy the, the homegrown player rule um, and, uh, or the association-trained uh, player rule. In other words, guys who are not English. And, uh, uh, and, and Walker, of course, has the right passport for it as well. And I think uh, Spurs knew that. They're tough negotiators. And uh, they held out for the price they wanted. Guys, I will be the first to scoff at the price. Not because it's $50 million for a right back, but because it's $50 million for a, at the end of last season, not first choice right back. Is that fair? It is fair, but it's a market we live in. And, but you, you look at it from the perspective of Manchester City who a couple of weeks ago seemed to have the deal done with Dani Alves that would have been a free transfer. And so, financially speaking, 50 million, I don't care how you look at it, it's a lot of money. And so I know that this, this checks a box for the English player and all these other things, and, and, and that plays a part into this and the negotiation for Spurs, and Spurs obviously letting a player go that was important to them to some degree. But I still feel that Kyle Walker feels a need for Manchester City. And let's not forget that at one point last season, Jesus Navas was playing right back for Manchester City. So, look, maybe it's desperate times. Maybe it's the fact that Dani Alves is no longer an option. Maybe you don't see many other options out there. You go for the guy who, who you know, who you have seen, who has performed well in the Premier League, and you trust that he's going to do a job for you. Stevie, pretty big drop-off from Dani Alves to Kyle Walker. Pep's kind of settling here, isn't he? Um, I would suggest that right now, Dani Alves is a better footballer than Kyle Walker. Certainly Kyle Walker will be able to play all season and he'll be able to play as many games as Pep wants him to play. I don't think you could say that about Alves, but I'm just a little surprised. I, not, surprised is not the word. I guess what I should say is, I think the fact that they've paid £50 million for Kyle Walker, number one, he's overpriced, number two, the way he plays the game. He's all about pace and power and getting up and down. That's not the kind of player you associate with Pep Guardiola. You associate football players. So I think, it, I think the market is, is really lacking in certainly full-back talent. Go ahead, Gab. No, I was going to say, um, it's an interesting one there because uh, there, there, was another, there was another option, of course. So it would have been a guy like, uh, uh, like putting in a serious offer for, for Hector Bayer in. Who who's, was also linked uh, with uh, with Manchester City uh, for a long time and uh, uh, last season and uh, uh, you know for whatever reason they opted not to go down uh, that route um, but I agree with Stevie uh, certainly his style uh, doesn't seem like an obvious fit if you're going to have the fullback step inside like uh, like we saw earlier this season and he's very different from from Danny Alves uh, one area though where they're similar though is the durability we're not. Obviously, he's more durable than Danny Alves, but uh, we're not talking about, you know, one of those guys who plays every minute of every game either. Uh, Kyle Walker's had some injury concerns uh, in the past, so I don't even know that he's going to be sort of an automatic plug-and-play 55 games a season type player. 